Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas, everyone, and a happy new year. Merry Christmas and a happy new year. Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Christmas, everybody, and a happy new year from our family to yours. We hope you're having an amazing celebration with friends, family, and of course, Jesus Christ, because this is a season of celebration. And we want to wish you a Merry Christmas from the Freedom Fellowship family to yours all over the world. Uh, we're excited for the amazing opportunities God is opening up for each and every one of us. And we're excited for this new year that's coming about. But this year is not finished yet. So um, hold on tight to see what God does. The Lord gave us a wonderful, encouraging message today about now being a time of golden opportunities. So if you haven't listened to the message, last Sunday's message, please do so because you'll be so excited and so encouraged. God said that he also is hitting the reset button again. Opportunities for suddenlies, for restoration, for everything that we need. So I encourage you, to listen to the message. Merry Christmas, everybody. God wants to bless all of us. And I pray that God will expand your capacity to believe and expand your capacity to receive during this golden opportunity time. God bless you. Merry Christmas from all of us here at Freedom Fellowship Church and Sons of God Ministries International. We're downtown here in San Antonio, Texas, right by the Riverwalk, and we want to wish you a Merry Christmas. God has told us that this is a season of harvest, this is a season of acceleration, this is a season of manifestations. So I encourage you, focus on the promises of God. He has promised so much. If we focus on His Word, He is so faithful and He is so powerful to manifest it in our lives, in this nation, and in your own respective nations. Merry Christmas, everybody, from Freedom Fellowship Church and Sons of God International. We are downtown San Antonio right now, in the heart of our city, at a historic spot. There's, there's trees that have been here for hundreds and hundreds of years. And it's significant, I believe, that we're here today at the historic beginning of this city because God has spoken of a reset that is taking place in the nations and the body of Christ to reset and to replace those things that have been put out of order to bring them back into order by the kingdom of God, by the God's ways of doing things. So I'm here to tell you, be excited, get ready for the greatest move of God that we have ever seen in the nation and in, in your life individually. Whatever God has spoken over your life, if you've messed up in days past, put it behind you and put your hands in God's hands and He will see you through. We are about to see the greatest move that we have ever seen in this nation and in the nations of the world. Merry Christmas, everyone. This greeting is coming from our most beautiful river walk in our beloved city, San Antonio, Texas. And I just want to want to share with you what this Christmas me means for all of us. The, the Lord said that this is a golden opportunity. There will be many golden opportunities for all of us to be restored, uh, to for the Lord to have a reset in our lives and in our nations. And I just wanted to share this with you, get excited, what to expect for, uh, for this Christmas season throughout the year. And the next decade and new year is we're going to experience harvest, we're going to experience uh, restoration, reset, acceleration, suddenly, and of course, everything will end up in celebration. So join us in celebrating our Lord Jesus Christ, who, as a son of God, chose a downgrade to be born of a virgin and to, to, be, to be identified with us as a son of man, just for us to be reconciled to our Father God, to, to our Creator. So what a wonderful Savior we have. So for, for, this, uh, for this New Year, if you have a New Year's resolution, let us be our New Year's resolution to spend more time with Him, to minister before Him, and continue to thank and trust Him all the days of our lives. Amen? Again, Merry Christmas from San Antonio, Texas. And so, we are seeing this Christmas season as a season of celebration. We are celebrating Jesus Christ, we are celebrating God and His promises, and we are celebrating the move of God that He's going to bring here on the earth, the likes of which the world has never seen before. So God bless all of you, Merry Christmas, and a Happy New Year.